Got some fresh eucalyptus leaf. was some serious vaping. I mean, look at this thing. It's like a huge, gigantic atomizer. Okay, what we just did was a traditional remedy for treating bronchitis. I actually remember this from my granny. She was really treating us with this when we were sick. The reason we present this process here is because it represents what the vaping principles are and it can show us, it will show us, what are the basic difference of vaping and smoking tobacco leaves. The purpose of this process is that the patient inhales the water vapor containing the eucalyptus oil and take it into his lungs. Now let's see what happens in a molecular level. Of course we have our heating source and we put a kitchen pot with water on top. Once the water boils up, we put our fresh eucalyptus leaves inside. The eucalyptol molecule exists naturally inside the leaves and for the next 5 to 10 minutes, some of them will dissolve in the water. We have our modified towel on top, and through this, the molecules will travel along with the water vapor inside the patient's mouth. Once he inhales, the eucalyptol molecules will go directly into his lungs. So we got what we want, the antibacterial eucalyptol molecules into the infected lungs. This is a very similar process with vaping, at least as in its principle. Let's consider now doing the same healing remedy using the tobacco smoking method. In order to do this, we would first have to take the eucalyptus leaves, dry them up, cut them in little pieces, put them in a cigarette paper, roll it up, light it up, and inhale the smoke. And by doing this, the patient would insert in his lungs all the byproducts of the burning process. This is a combustion of organic material that creates thousands of chemicals that end up in the patient's lungs. This is the cigarette mentality method. You get the drug in your lungs, but together you get all the byproducts of the burning of the leaves. It also smells bad and tastes bad. And it's no wonder, it's no brainer why the old people used the vaping method rather than the burning method. And this is the difference between vaping and smoking. In its principle, vaping delivers nicotine into your lungs via a vapor carrier. Smoking delivers nicotine into your lungs via a smoking carrier. The smoking carrier contains tar, and if you're a long-term smoker, the tar accumulates in your lungs, causing you a big risk of getting cancer. And this is the conclusion of this video. I know that almost every vapor knows about this, they know that what's happening, but there are many people that don't. If you ask them, they will say that vaping is as bad as smoking. And I believe the reason is, is, is just this, they don't understand the difference in principle of vaping and smoking. And I'm sure that if they understand using the common sense, just their basic guts, their basic instinct, like watching this video and understanding the basic principles, I'm sure I feel that they will feel that vaping is a much safer way to insert nicotine into the human body than is 
breathing the smoke from tobacco leaves. If you have any questions, any doubts, if we missed something or if we said it in the wrong way, please comment down below because I would love to see a discussion about this subject. For all you vapors out there, keep vaping proudly. Much love, see you in the next video. Many vape kisses.